Okay. Hey guys, we are gonna be making some orange cupcakes today. Today, our vegetable ingredient is gonna be, what's the thing? <laughs> Butternut squash and carrots. So what I did already, yes, and then because we could make yes. rainbow cupcakes. Yes, and then after that, we're gonna make some rainbow cupcakes. Ellie, you gotta come over here, or else they're not gonna see you. Get closer to your brother. Okay. So I got Elliot, Emmett, and Emerson. All my E's. I know, right? We got a lot of E's. So anyway, in here I have the butternut squash and my yeah, carrots. The so the carrots is actually one cup of shredded carrots and I blended that up with the butternut squash. I will show you guys the packet. It's basically just a packet of frozen butternut mm. squash. I got it from Audi. So nothing fancy, cooked it up and then blended it up with the carrots. Mm -hmm. Nothing else has been added to this, just that. So, first thing we're going to start with are the eggs, right? Yeah. I so, want to crack one. Okay. Let's crack I one. I want to crack it first. All right. So, everybody gets to crack one egg. I have one. Okay, let's wait for Elliot to crack his first. And the boys washed their hands already, so we're starting off with clean hands. Good. And, of course, if your kids are helping you do this, you will probably end up with a few pieces of the shells in there, but that's cool. I'll just pick it out. Go ahead, open it up. Open it up a little better, Elliot. And I really like it when the boys help me with these kind of things, because then it makes them a little bit more interested in eating it versus me yeah. doing all of the work. Your eyes is matching and mine just do it. Yeah, you did a good job. I think both of you guys did a good job too. So, good job, boys. Yeah. Good job. And then after we cracked up our eggs, instead of using milk or anything like that, I'm just going to use like a plain gluten-free, dairy-free yogurt and put one cup of that in there. So Why? Yeah. Uh, just what? for milk purposes, Emmett. So okay. we're going to open this up. And I'm want, just going to... I want some. Put it in there too. Can I have some? Some of the yogurt? Yeah. Well, you can have another kind of yogurt. This one does not taste that good. There's no sugar in there. So, go ahead. You want to mix it up a little bit? So, we're doing this at our dining table. So, I don't have an outlet that's close by. So, I'm just going to be using, like, the mixer head to mix this up. Okay. Aliyah, let Emma help to mix it, too. Go ahead, Emma. You can mix them now. You should yeah. put, that, put that down, and then you can mix it up a little bit. Good. good job, good job, good job. And with the gluten-free flour and like the gluten-free cake mix that we're going to be using. Can I have some now? No, not yet, buddy. It tends to be a little dry, so I definitely love to add some butter to it. Let There's nothing taste. worse. Let me taste some of it. Okay, not yet. It's not time yet for you to taste it. But like I was saying, I like to add some butter to my mixture a little bit more than what the box would say. So I'm going to be adding this ghee butter and I'm actually adding one third of a cup to it. So let's get in there. And I love this butter because it adds good flavor to it without really adding salt. So let's do that. Can I mix this part, Elliot? Thank you. Oh, sure. One. Can I sip some? You, no, that's no, not what that when is for. When so do you, do you taste some now? Not yet, Make not yet, kiddo. Bake. We have our butter in there, and I'm just going to add a little what bit of vanilla. What should we do? We are going to add some vanilla to it, because vanilla makes everything taste yummy. Yeah. Everything tastes yummy with vanilla. There we go. So with the vanilla, the bottle was literally empty, so I just added what was left in there. But that's for you to decide on how much you want to add. And we have company coming, so come on in, y'all. Okay, so we got our vanilla in there. Now, I want to taste some. I get the vanilla. Can I get some now? No, you cannot taste some yet. Not yet. We don't have everything in it yet. What's next? This thing is 
wet. We're not gonna add that there yet. We have to add some stuff to that first, okay? So we have all of this mixed up and we're just gonna put it to the side. And I'm yeah, gonna get... all over the place. I know, let me get the mess out of the way. Thank you, Elliot, for pointing that out to me. So now, all of the things that we don't need, I'm gonna get it out of the way. In the trash. Yeah, in the trash. Okay, so next up, I'm just gonna get a little bowl for this part because it's gonna be not too complicated. So we have one cup of almond flour. I just got this bag from where Walmart, yeah, but you can get it anywhere, it really does not matter. Please, please, so don't, that's, do, please don't spill it all. I am not gonna spill it all, I promise. So that was in here. I'm gonna take that and pour it in there. And then we are going to use one fourth of a teaspoon of baking powder, right? Yeah. Yeah. So we get that, measure it out that much, put it in there, close that up. Is, is that the baking powder? This is the baking soda. That's the baking powder. So we have a big thing of baking soda, so I just pour some in this yogurt cup, and we're going to use one fourth teaspoon of baking soda as well so we'll put that in there and we just need now to mix it up so mommy needs to get something to mix it up okay and salt yeah and a little bit of salt so you want to sprinkle some salt nope i think that's enough just a little bit goes a long way so we mix so, that up, and then Emmett, I'm gonna let you add some sugar. Yeah. Okay, good. Want... So instead of using regular sugar, I'm actually please, using sweetener. Please don't get them all. I'm not gonna use it all. I promise. So I have a one fourth of a cup measuring cup right here. I'm gonna use that to get some sugar out. I'm actually not gonna use an entire one fourth. It'll probably be like a little less because I don't want it to be too sweet. We are gonna put some icings on top of this cupcake and what I'm trying to avoid is that extra sweetness. I'm making rainbow cupcakes. Yeah, we'll make the rainbow cupcakes too. So we'll put a little bit less, kind of like half of that one fourth cup. So we take that and you put it in there, Emmett. Yeah, myself. Mm -hmm. Put it in there. No, nope, not. Good job, put Emmett. Yourself. Well, you got to do it too. Now, mommy's gonna mix this up. Okay. He's not letting me in doing it. So, next okay. step, we're gonna bring this bowl back over. And now this is our almond flour, baking powder, baking soda, salt, and sweetener in here. And we're going to take that and Emmet or Elliot. Elliot, you can do this part. Okay. You pour it in there. Pour it all in there. Good job. Mix it all up in there. Good. We put can that I? one aside. And then, hold on. Wait one second, please. Now, this is the part. So I use one cup of this gluten-free yellow cake mix because it just adds extra flavor and the almond flour has a little bit more of a greeny texture this one is really really smooth a so it's a great thing to mix it up with just for a lot of good freshness nope emma gets to pour it now so emma you do pour that it, emma, pour it. good job so now we're gonna take this back up emma and we're gonna mix it all up in there Good job. So when I was saying before that I don't want it to it be too looks, sweet because we're gonna get to the cake mix. That's what I meant. Like, yes, yeah, why why didn't they stay? Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Okay. Um, and that? Are we making rainbow cupcakes now? Well, we gotta add our special yummy ingredient. So now we're gonna take this mixture and put it in there. Well, first, before I do that, let me show you guys the consistency. So it's basically just looking like a regular cake mix. And then we're going to take this and add it in there. Whoa! What is, what are the ingredients for this? 
Rainbow cupcakes. Uh, the same as what we're doing. For, for the rainbow one. Mm -hmm. And, and can I make the... the yes, the, you can, Emma. Go ahead and make the... What is... Hi, are, hi. What are... They were making the rainbow when they blend you. Well, right now we're trying to make the orange cupcakes, right? Because that's the color it's turning, right? Turning <laughs> really orange. Hi, buddy. Hi, Emerson. You are doing such a great job. Hi. Oh, don't taste it yet. Let me help mix it. Good job, Emmett. Good job, bud. Mix it all up. Well, well. Now can I taste it? Now you can taste it. Okay. Oh, Emma. No, that's too much. It's okay. The it is this okay. is way too much. I agree. It is too much. Emma, we don't eat an entire handful of it. Okay, Elliot. Dip and out. We don't just hang out in it. Okay, y'all. So here is the color that it is now. So I kind of need it to be a little bit more orange than what it is now so i have a gluten-free full coloring that i'm gonna add to it just a few drops and i got this from sans let me say sans gloves from sprouts sorry about that but i'm sure you can get it from amazon or whole foods or any other store i don't know if i've seen it at it walmart it's red it's red i know it's probably gonna get a little less red in a little bit um can go. I make rainbow cupcakes now? Yes, after we get done, we're going to... Can I just one more? No, Emma. We have to cook it up and then we can eat it. We cannot just keep on eating it when it's not cooked. So I here is the color baby. of it now. A little... I think you, baby. No, Papa. I know you're hungry, but we're going to make it up first. So here is the color. It's a little bit more pronounced, which is what we're going for. And now all we have to do is just... Mix it well mixed it well i think it's mixed pretty well but okay don't put your hands in it and taste it anymore we're all done tasting right boys mm -hmm. now it's time for us to get to bacon you did such a great job emerson you made your first cupcake you taste ah! some that isn't there? no okay that's enough mixing so i'm gonna get my cupcake are we can making and put it in it and then we'll show it to you guys now. after it's all done. Are we making rainbow cupcakes now?